Okay, so, um, hi. I'm going to teach you people how to get shinies that have, like, a way higher chance of appearing than usual shinies. I'm bad at talking. So, there's a thing called catch combos. And so, if you catch, like, a bunch of one Pokemon, then it can't give you a catch combo. And catch combos are, like, super good because they get, give you a bunch of extra XP and have a sh higher chance of getting you a shiny. And so, I have a 39 catch combo of chances, and it just gives me, like, such a high chance uh, <coughs> to high to find uh, shinies but I'm pretty sure it's only shinies for that Pokemon I'm not completely sure mm. and something just appeared oh yeah Dragonite and so if you it's like a 1 in 500 chance if you have like a 31 catch combo 31 gives you the highest amount of shiny chance. And so, if any Pokemon flee or anything, if any Pokemon flee from you, or if you catch a different Pokemon, then your combo breaks. It also breaks if you uh, close your game. But, um, it, the combos give, are, are, like, super good if you're trying to shiny hunt. And if you do it with chances, it can give you so much XP, it's insane. Like, one chancy can just give you 45,000 XP. Like, even a low-level chancy, like this one, which is, let's see, it's only level 39. If you catch it, if I can actually catch it, okay. And you actually manage to catch it, because chances are really hard to catch, then it can give you so much XP. Chances give the most XP in the game. So this just gives you 34,000 XP, and it's only like level 36 or something. <clears throat> and so if you keep catching chances with lore, by using lores in Cerulean Cave, then you can get so many, <clears throat> you can get so much XP. And the place I find best to find them is in Cerulean Cave. Just... There are a ton of chances if you use a lure. And so you'll want to use a lure because chances are considered a rare Pokemon. But you can do this with any Pokemon. And you will have a, a really high chance of it being a shiny. Well, not a high chance, but an increased chance. So <clears throat> if a Pokemon flees, then of course it breaks. If I catch this Doduo here, it breaks. If I close my game, it breaks. So it's really. And so uh, there are also things called taunt animations, and it tells you when they're gonna flee. So if you run away from a Pokemon, it doesn't break your streak. It's only if you run. So if I go to like a Chansey. Or something. I don't know why I'm always using chances. I just am. If I can actually find it in the Pokédex, okay. If I look at a chancy, if you do the movements, first one will be its attacking one. Then it might be its next one, which is this one. And this is when a chancy is about to flee. And you can check this with any Pokémon in the Pokédex. And uh, if you see that, you run. So it doesn't break your streak. Otherwise, it's really sad. Because then your streak is broken and you have to catch all the chances all over again. So this is a really good 
the way to farm XP and find shinies. So, yeah. Bye. <laughs>